Okay, um, I got the image off of Google and added the text myself. And I have to make the color all black so it shows up nice on the glass. You right click on your layer, layer zero, uh, go to blending options, go to color overlay, click it again, yes. pick black, press OK, and you're good from there. And then you click image, and then you click image rotation, then you click 90 degree clockwise. Oh wait, counterclockwise. And then you're you're done pretty much. Okay, so um now we're gonna send it to the printer. You go to file print you click on your printer which is the Epilog Mini 903 go to print settings that's all okay then you make this 18 and your vertical is going to be 12 click autofocus center center then you make speed 20 and you make power 85 and you're good from there then you go um, down to position and size unclick center center make it zero zero and you should write all that down before so you have it beforehand and you click print so then you take your glass and you put a light coat of soap around it so that the soap dish soap to be exact so that the soap collects the shards of glass so that you won't cut yourself and then you put a rubber band around it and then I recommend you put two rubber bands so that you won't drop your glass and it won't slip or anything. Notice how there is one rubber band on top of the other. So the rollers are in and make sure you put the rubber bands directly between the two black bands and then you press pointer and then you press XY off and you press go to confirm everything and then you move your laser to the center of your glass and then you press set home and then you press reset and then you press go all right oh yeah it's you. <laughs> all right so now we're just we're gonna send um, our picture to the printer and then we're gonna start it so we're gonna press go because we're ready to go we got everything right <laughs> and then it's just so with the soap it gets very slippery so if it falls you might want to stop it and reset it when the glass is done make sure that you're going to wash off all the soap obviously but when you're done with that dry it and take a white piece of paper or just regular old notebook paper and when it's all dry you want to rub the paper don't ever use um, sandpaper or anything too rough but just once it's dry and you got all the soap off rub it with a piece of paper and any shards that might still be there will get rubbed off um, cleanly and you'll have yourself done glass Boop.